And with that, we see the fires lit, the engines start to roar and lift off. Scott Tingle, Anton Shkaplerov, and Nora Sheehy Kenai on their way to the International Space Station. Anton Shkaplerov already calling down everything going well on board, everything reported fine. Performance calls coming in, the engines performing nominally or normally. Getting good first stage performance. The Soyuz delivering 930,000 pounds of thrust from those four boosters and that single core engine. The first stage measures 68 feet in length and 24 feet in diameter is going to burn liquid fuel for the first two minutes and six seconds into the flight. Still getting good performance calls. The crew feeling good as they light up the sky over there in Baikonur. Again, it's a clear day, so we should get pretty spectacular views of the rocket as it makes it eight, its eight minute, 45 second climb into orbit. Already more than one minute, 45 seconds into the flight. Everything's still going well with the rocket. And just there we see the first stage separating those four strap-on boosters breaking away. Their job completed, dropping away the rocket at an altitude already of about 28 statute miles. And you can see them making what's known the Koryov Cross. The four engines slowly going to make their way back down here to Earth. The vehicle now being propelled by the core stage traveling over 3,300 miles an hour already. Getting confirmation that the, the shroud has been jettisoned. The rocket is about 48 miles in height already. Also getting views still inside the cabin. You can see a quick wave. At this point, the vehicle is traveling at a speed of about 4,700 miles an hour. And again, the second stage, that core stage performing as expected. It measures 56 feet in length. 13 and a half feet in diameter with that single engine and four fuel chambers getting a wave and a thumbs up from Norishigi Kanai there. Sitting in the right seat making his first flight into orbit today along with Scott Tingle. The seasoned veteran in the middle there, Anton Shkaplerov, overseeing the rocket's flight into orbit. Again, under that second stage right now, we're already three minutes and 50 seconds since the liftoff. <laughs> 